So I can look back to why did I join Arup um, a year ago? And really the world is facing a challenge in terms of decarbonisation that it's never faced before. And we have to totally revolutionise the energy infrastructure, how energy is created, how it's used and how it's transported. One of our values is total architecture. And for energy, that's really about the holistic solutions. And we bring together capabilities from across Arup, whether that's engineering or digital or advisory, to help our clients really solve some of the most challenging questions that the world faces. And at Arup, we bring together those engineers that can design the projects to create new fuels, along with experts in ports who can create the infrastructure to deliver those fuels to the vessels or to the aeroplanes. And then in experts in the use of those fuels in planes or in boats, and actually by marrying all of that together, we can drive the decarbonisation of those really hard sectors. Everybody is motivated to share the best of themselves, to give the best that they can to the client. So whether that's somebody from Australia helping with a project in the UK or a civil engineer in Europe helping somebody with a digital project in the US, those boundaries are very, very fungible and people turn up to work wanting to create new, excellent quality deliverables but doing it in a hugely collaborative way. One of the things that I have found exciting and continues to excite me every day is the breadth of clients that we work with across all the different parts of the energy system, the value chain, the supply chain. So whether we're creating new fuels or using them or figuring out how to build electrolyzers to produce hydrogen, we're working with clients doing all of that and I learn something every day and it's given me a new energy and new motivation which I didn't think I could have found at this point in my career.